From California State University, San Bernardino, it's Local Matters. St. Patrick's Day. Hello, I'm Ricardo Hernandez, and welcome to Local Matters, featuring stories from across the Inland Empire. And I'm Brittany Jo Henningmeyer. Let's flash back to St. Patrick's Day 2009. Reporter Rudy Segura tries to catch a leprechaun. For St. Patrick's Day, we go on a journey to find out what's at the end of a rainbow. In 432 AD, St. Patrick came to Ireland for a mission to convert the Irish into Christians. I was wondering what the end of a rainbow looked like, a pot of gold, a leprechaun, I don't know, but I was willing to find out. Leprechauns are common characters within Irish mythology. I was interested in capturing one. I was told all I needed was a couple shamrocks, and eventually, if you waited long enough, the leprechaun would come. My patience reached its limit. March 17th is the day we celebrate St. Patrick's Day because of the death of St. Patrick himself. The sun is out, the clouds have cleared, but the St. Patrick's Day rainbow is never ending. For Local Matters, I'm Rudy Segura. This year for St. Patrick's Day, I devised a new plan to pick up where Rudy left off. Let's take a look. It's that time of the year again, the celebration of St. Patrick's Day. And this year, we traveled to Ireland again with one goal in mind, to catch a leprechaun. I've just stolen Lucky's box of charms, and we're going to use this as bait to lure him into our trap. Let's oh, do it. Fiddly, fiddly, catch him, it'll be quick or I'll be gone. Fiddly, fiddly, catch him, it'll be I'm a leprechaun. Back in old Ireland, in days of yore, there lived a little man who seldom seen any more. Stood six inches high and always dressed in green. A master of the magic, the best ever seen. Wearing silver buckles and golden bells, and he would go a singing through the day. We've caught ourselves a leprechaun! Catch him, me, quick or I'll be gone. Fiddly, diddly, catch him, me, I'm a leprechaun. Now, what does one do with a captured leprechaun? a leprechaun on St. Patrick's Day. For Local Matters, I'm Brittany Jo Henningmeyer. They're after me, Lucky Charms! With that, we wish you a happy St. Patrick's Day. I'm Ricardo Hernandez. And I'm Brittany Jo Henningmeyer. Join us next time for more local stories that matter. <laughs> My name is William Aguilar. I'm the uh, Vice President for University Advancement at California State University, San Bernardino. We must educate many more Latinos if California is going to maintain the same kind of economic vitality that it's had historically. I would invite all of you to attend the March 29th Latino Education and Advocacy Day Summit so that you can hear topics on the value and importance of Latinos in higher education. As your business searches for smart ways to save, don't forget about the one that's right in front of you. Switch to the Charter Business Bundle and you can save big without sacrificing a thing. Get reliable business telephone and high-speed internet with local support and great features. Power your business with great savings starting today. It's easy to pay less and get more. Call now and make a switch to the Charter Business Bundle.